Warning, if you are against the consumptive use and the ethical harvest of fur-bearing animals, please leave this channel now. This is no place for pansies, sissies, or crybabies. Hey trappers, Dale Billingsley here, Billingsley Brand Lures. Uh, guys, I think there's some things we need to clear up just a little bit, uh, especially when it comes to bait and lure making. Guys, I'm not trying to be a prick. I'm honestly not. But if you think you're going to call me up or message me and ask me questions about making bait and lure, you're, you're sadly mistaken, okay? If you can ask me anything you want, I will answer anything that I want. You know, this is honestly a, and truly a labor of love, okay? We love doing this or we wouldn't be doing it. Um, I don't see anybody else standing down here gutting fish and pulling eggs and pulling fat for six, eight hours of an evening when they could be at home with their wife and family. Um, I'm doing this, you know, this is a big part of my yearly income is selling bait and lure, okay? I don't come to your job asking you you know, to take a cut in pay. I don't come and ask you for the pins to your accounts, you know, so please don't ask me for mine. That's that's kind of what I'm getting at here. Um, you know, like I said a minute ago, this is this is honestly a labor of love. We love doing this or we wouldn't be doing it. Um, you know, so don't think for a minute that I'm just gonna hand the keys of the truck over to you, because it's not gonna happen. I've been playing at this since I've been about 14 years old, um, you know, is when I started playing, making baits and lures. Um, you know, went into business to, in 1997, I think. Went out of business in 2008. Uh, jumped back in it again there a few years ago with different formulas. Um, you know, there's a lot of time, there's a lot of money involved in making the, these baits and lures in volume. You know, let's just say, for instance, you know, you you know, we're allowed to have real Tonquin musk again. Okay, well, an empty pod. Okay, there's nothing in it. It's just an empty pod, a Tonquin pod, is seven hundred and fifty dollars. You know, I don't see many, you know, many guys going out and buying one. You know, when a full one is going to cost you up around four or five thousand dollars, probably. You know, I haven't priced it, but I'm just speculating. Um, there's a lot that goes into this, a lot more than what guys realize. You know, a, a, a pint of Ambrette musk is $150. Uh, one pint of shellfish oil is, is $90 of the, of, the, of the pure uncut stuff. Plus, you've got a $10 hazmat charge on that to get it to you. Then you've got the time it takes to, to cut it to the degree that you want it or whatever, you know, I mean, fish oil you know if you want if you want to buy the press fish oil you can buy it all day long but if you want the real mccoy you've got to stand down here like i am this evening and pull fat and pull eggs and all that good stuff you know my truck is literally level bed full and i'm going to be here six eight hours with a threatening thunderstorm coming in to get this done um, in fact i shouldn't even be making this video but i feel that it was time you know i've had several guys now who have messaged me with questions and wanting me to answer it. And guys, I apologize to you, but I, I'm just not gonna do it. It's just not gonna happen. Um, so anyway, enough of that. Let's move on. Uh, I appreciate y'all tuning in to watch. I really do. I appreciate everything you've done for my channel and for my lure business as well. Guys, I mean that sincerely. I, I honestly appreciate it. Uh, once again, this is Dale Billingsley with another one. Signing out.